All right, guys, Nick here uh, with Adrenaline Cycles. We're at the BRP show. Of course, we got the all new HD 11 Defender, and here's the cutaway of the engine. We'll try to give you a preview, what they changed. Um, coming around, you'll see it's a three cylinder 999cc engine. Uh, resembles the X3 a whole lot, but Toggle Engineers, you know, basically they took, used the same design, built a whole new engine. So it's 100 cc's bigger. Uh, cams, everything's different board, different stroke. Uh, built for torque, you know, it's built for that machine, not a high performance one. Uh, so you can see we've got it's got a fully enclosed sealed belt box. Uh, I don't see, you know, on X3s people worry about busting, but this is not going to be an issue on one of these anyways. Uh, it went with a P drive. You got an updated clutch, a lot quieter, smoother operation. Uh, Clutch cover, they've gone went so far, add the insulation to this. Uh, again, they're going so far trying to keep these things quiet as can be. Everything's sealed up. Uh, I mean, these P drive, the P drive clutch, and talking with them, everything specific to every model. Um, you'll get a cab model, will be a little smoother engaging than an XMR because they've all got their own setup in the weights, uh, rollers, all that. Uh, secondary standard I mean that's basically across the board what was there no big updates there you can see the new intake plenum all these specific to this motor uh, now the transmission back here you see it will have the same uh, turf mode you can lock it unlock it for the yard uh, the gears See, all this stuff's compact, squished down to keep the cargo bed, weight, everything low. Uh, talking now, the XMR did get lower gearing. Uh, I want to say it was like 17% on the XMR, high and low. Uh, so that's great for that platform. Everybody asked that. Uh, coming around. Of course, specs, 1,700 watt stator. That's a little bit over double what they were for the Defender. So that's a great upgrade, especially all these Defenders now are running. You know, you've got your AC running fan motors, uh, the controls to them, the big stereo tops they're adding. So that's a great upgrade. Big thing you'll notice right here, they went the old Defender motor, had a little plastic cover, but it's an open design. You had a compressor up here. Now this is completely sealed. For the guys wanting the limited to go mud bogging, uh, you got a big, thick rubber gasket in here. Plenty of bolts keep this thing clamped tight on here. The compressor sealed from the back. All this will be watertight to keep this belt sealed out of the elements. I mean, they really went a long ways to make the AC, this is the next step, getting all this to work in the environment which this unit is built to perform in. Um, and from the front, you can see, you truly see now it's three cylinder, but they just got to cut away of the extra pipe here and how much it resembles the X3. Uh, one of the other things we'd ask him about the four wheel drive, this thing has even went so far, they've added, well, what the lockout, like the Mavr. Use the same engagement slash carry burn as a Mavr. So your power will go from the engine all the way to the center console where it has that engagement, disengaging, engaging when you need it. Uh, I mean, a lot of developments went into this. Super nice uh, upgrade. Uh, I think everybody, I mean, we're, I can't wait to get in one of these and try it. It's going to be super nice, guys. Um, you know, hopefully we'll have them on the floor. Come and see us in a month or so.